Hey guys, TPAO2 here, and I have an unboxing from ShooterCBGear.com, and uh, I'll have a link for that site in the description. As you see in the title, it is a MODI JPC and uh, Comtag 2 unboxing. Actually, uh, I don't know if that's going to be in the title, but probably will be. But uh, I'm in my pajamas right now. It's a snow day, day off, so that's why I'm like that. They had a really weird uh, boxing style here. There's like a bump on the top, as you can see. But uh, I'm going to try to get into it here. And this is from Hong Kong, by the way. I ordered it uh, on Tuesday, last Tuesday, and it's Wednesday, so it took a week and one day. It should have taken six days instead of eight, but it was like ten minutes from my house, and then they shipped it out f further away from my house, and then they shipped it back. Fine, though, it's here now. Cool. So, they really packed it in here in this small box. Um, yeah, there we go. Don't really want to cut the vest or my plate carrier. So, first thing out is my MODI JPC, and I'll take it out of the bag here and tell you why I got this over any other replica or the real one, which is from Kai. Okay, so... This is the MODI JPC. It's a really small compact plate carrier. It's a replica of the Cry JPC, which costs two hundred sixty dollars, give or take, uh, wherever you're buying it. Uh, and the Cry JPC is the best, obviously, because it's the real steel one that PJs use and a bunch of Marsoc guys use and stuff. Uh, but this is $65. It has the cry style shoulder pads that are in multicam. It has great stitching. Um, everything is pretty much accurate to the real JPC. Unlike the Emerson and the other replicas which have tan shoulder pads and the stitching is not as good. So that's basically why I got uh, the MODI JPC from Shooter CB. And shipping was not that bad. It was about $10. So, I'll have a full review just on this vest after I use it a bit, but that's just first impressions and why I got it. And the second thing, and I'm really excited about this, um, excited about both actually, this is the Z Tactical uh, Contact 2 headset, and TPA01 has it, and I wanted someone else to get it first before I actually bought it, so that was good. I like this headset. I've used it before. Comes in a nice box. Has a uh, woodland cover over the head strap. And that's our team camo, so that, that works out really nicely. Um, and overall, it's just a great headset, and I'll have a review separately of this too later on after I use it. So, thanks for watching, guys. TPA02 out.